Hi, my name is Trish now. I'm on the Textile Design and Design Management course. I'm in my final year and um, I'm really enjoying it. I'm a final year student on the Management and Marketing of Fashion and Textiles course. Um, first and foremost, the one thing I would say about MMFT is that it's not just your average management and marketing course. I think Manchester is a really great city to, to be in. Um, the amount of people you'll actually meet, they're from completely different cultures, different countries. You know, it's really international in that aspect as well. I chose Manchester because it was a BSc course. It's very different from the other courses um, in the UK and it is very, very individual and you can you get a lot out of it. The structure of the course is as in first year we spend a lot of time learning about textiles, the basics, so we spend some time in the labs looking at weaving and spinning and knitting. You learn the processes behind it, you learn the business aspect and you learn the chemistry aspect and the technical aspects of fabrics and how they're made, how they're processed. And then as the course progresses into second and third year we look at more applying what we've learnt, we look at applied management, marketing, supply chain aspects, all sorts of things like that all applied to the textile industry. You learn how to design for a particular company and brand and you make sure your designs cater to that to, so you get the right customer. During my second year I decided that I really wanted to do a placement because I wanted to get that kind of experience. Um, so I started applying for um, placements and I found one at Jack Wills and Auburn and Wills. Just got the job, um, had a great year there, learnt so much. Got to travel to America on my own to do the window display, had some amazing, amazing experiences and I'm going back actually to um, be the product presentation coordinator in August. In your final year you have a lot of freedom to pick what aspect uh, within the fashion industry you want to concentrate on. So for my entire final year project um, I've been working on the luxury sector. So throughout my project I concentrated on one client, um, who she was for Thomas the brand. I literally went through a full portfolio of accessories that we designed for her, pieces for her as well. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's been an amazing kind of experience, kind of really trying to figure out who the client is. We were lucky enough to do Marks & Spencer and we took a trip over to Paris to go and have a look at their store to experience it as a consumer would. And then we compared it to their UK strategy, how they work over here, to theirs overseas. In final year, I decided to base my project, my design project, on the Olympic Games in 2012. Therefore, my market was for spring, summer 2012 for high-end women's wear fashion. So I um, did some preliminary artwork based on athletes and the concept of the games using circle dots to represent crowds of people and tube maps to represent the London aspect of the games. This is my final print collection. I decided to do digital print for my end collection. You kind of learn a lot about the fabric structures, how to put them in repeat, so here at, we have a placement design based on the rowers. Um, we have a straight match repeat, a border design, and um, a five spot repeat and stripe design. The best thing I've learned in the course itself is to be very versatile. The course itself is a very, very versatile course. You know, you come in, you do a lot of design, you do a lot of marketing and PR, and you'll also learn other aspects, you know, which are a bit more scientific. It is a BSc degree at the end of the day. One thing that I really love about the course is the academic staff, the um, skilled and the expertise they bring to their work. The tutors are really supportive, they understand what you're doing. Um, you, you can get a lot of help if you need it as well. I think it was the best decision I've ever made. 